Look, everybody, it's the 31st, September 2020. So you got your one clear day yesterday. So now it's right back to garbage. Humidity is 98%. Not that that matters, but I always like to say it. It's for argument's sake. I have no clue what this asshole's doing. There you go. Turn signal last minute. And you got a mask on, you stupid bastard. Anyway. Uh, so the sky's blown out with chemtrails. I don't see any coal ash clouds at the moment. Um, they must have sprayed all night. So the humidity was the same yesterday morning as it is today. And the sky was completely clear all day. Um, so there's nothing different other than the fact that the military is spraying our skies with sun, some unknown substance, which we pretty much know is liquefied coal ash because of the abundance of it and it's um, super fine particulate matter as in making a good binder to bind to other chemicals to blanket the sky. The military did that in the 40s and 50s. Um, they would put up these nasty chemical curtains. Jeez. Way to beat up on your car, woman. Whacking those fucking speed bumps at like 30. So, um... So yesterday was your one clear day, one true clear day, which I documented several times. And now it's straight back into shitville, right? So we'll see how the day progresses. Oh, I got coal ash clouds down here. Ah, there's a big surprise scumbag pricks all right so we'll keep this video rolling all right just to show that you get one day if you're lucky out of 30 of one clear day big surprise right those are coal ash clouds over there right there yep so obviously the stain plant is right back to its old tricks and humidity is the same as yesterday. Everything's the same. Temperature is the same. So we know that it has nothing to do with nothing. It's them making the weather. And the military destroying the skies. Which isn't hidden. Um, they don't deny that. You can look up weather modification. You'll come up with probably a thousand companies around the world that modify the weather around them. Uh, and they have to file permits to do it. What the fuck is that about? Oh, giant bank of chem shit here, or uh, coal ash cloud. And see, it's straight across too. So how creepy is that? Weather doesn't run in straight lines. Hate to tell you. Thursday. I don't know what day school's running. Well, the buses are out, so obviously it's running. So I probably won't be able to go down this steam plant because it'll take me two hours to get back to the shop. You can see this bank of chem crap right here over the treetops. It's the dark shit. traffic around here has become absolutely insane uh, because the amount of people that moved here and, and rightly so to flee the nasty weather from up north and the high taxes and all the bullshit uh, but the taxes are just continuing to crawl up down here too right because they're going to tax everybody so they put a tax on labor here which is so fucking retarded it's stupid um and it's just, they do it just to see if they can get away with it. And nobody revolts. 
So that's why it's done. Everybody just keeps, I will just keep paying it. Don't fucking pay it. All taxation's illegal. This is a British colony. This isn't the United States. It's the United States Corporation. You get it? Owned by the Vatican, owned by Rome, owned by Britain, uh, owned by the Rothschild banking cartel. They're the ones that started this country. They murdered the indigenous people, took the place over, installed a central bank, i.e. the Federal Reserve. Their collection agency is the henchman IRS. Internal Revenue System. An illegal entity. There's nothing federal about the Federal Reserve. The IRS does not exist in any government roster, nor does the Federal Reserve, because they are not legal government entities. They're private, um, for-profit institutions, robbing the people blind. Right? So fuck them. What are they going to do? So school must be starting late, because the traffic is normally wadded up by 7 o'clock. It's not wadded up yet. It's 8 o'clock. So here's a big, big wad of coal ash crap that's been farted out of the Marshall Steam Station. I'll tell you what, we'll we'll go down here and have a look at this because just to prove that that's where this this turd bank came from. It'll only take a minute. station yesterday. I filmed that. Uh, I can upload that. It was very uneventful, but uh, basically I didn't want to have a confrontation. So I might go back there today just to be a douche. We'll see. Um, I took all the guns out of my truck, all the ammunition. Therefore, you know, when I'm on the property, they can't say that I was a psycho coming in there to shoot the place up. dissipating off the top of the tower but what you can see is you can see a short time ago it was burning darker now you can see this straight line of dark shit right above it right and it kind of matches the last top exhaust right so you know that's where that came from so this thing changes color by the minute 
and so it's already dumped out a bunch of that big dark cloud that you saw and the wind's blown it uh, to the south so but it's not dark out and the sky isn't completely trashed because this place is barely running but there, the sky is is trashed with chemtrails so for sure really have to look towards the sun to see the chemtrail damage. Uh, see here, you now you can see it. Nasty shit everywhere. No blue skies anymore, people. I told you that last one day. Alright, I'm out of here.